In this video, we'll first see the lively memories behind some recently taken photos. Towards the end of the video, we'll go back in time, even to the 1950s and 1940s where photos taken back then will come to life. I'm sure your memories will also be revived. Do you remember? Not too long ago, just about 20 years ago, when we used to take photos, we couldn't immediately see those pictures. If you find this interesting, it means you were born after the 1990s. In the past, cameras had films that could take only 24 or at most 36 shots. You had to capture and take the perfect shot because your available shots were limited. Now, doesn't it sound absurd? When the shots in the camera ran out, we used to take out the film roll, bring it to the studio and wait for a few days for it to be developed. We would place each photo that came out of the studio into albums and keep them for years. First, digital cameras were introduced, and later, mobile phones started being used for photography. Those of us who used to take 36 photos throughout an entire holiday started taking 30 frames per second. So, what happened to those thousands of shots we took? Maybe we shared some of them on social media and documented them for history. But where are the memories we didn't share? The ones we lost when our phones malfunctioned. All the photos in this video are created from real videos and photos collected from followers and the immediate surroundings. We would be delighted if you choose to support us by subscribing. If you write the story behind your most unforgettable photo in the comments, we might be able to bring your memories to life in the next video. If you belong to the generation that used old cameras, we would love to hear your memories telling the younger generation about those days. Enjoy watching. Hey buddy, pose, I'm shooting a took.